Well, happy October morning. Oh, man, my nose is really cold this morning. October 2nd. And we've got our first frost. It got down to 31, 32. I don't know. I'll have to look. We were projected to be down into around there. 32, 33. Loading up the trailer this morning, hooking it up to uh, go get a little surprise. And look up the field. And cow is out. So before we take off, we gotta get her back in. Not exactly sure where she got out at, so I guess she'll tell me. Um, they usually go back to where they came from. So we'll see how this goes. Everybody's a little spunky. Of course, I guess if it was chilly, I'd probably be spunky if I lived outside too. at our location and we got our surprise loaded up so I want to show you what is going to be added to our family say hello might be hard to see but We've got uh, three heifers in here, and this little calf, that's bull calf, but he's gonna help us in transition to his mama. This is his mama right here. So she's first time heifer, and then we got these other two heifers in here that have not calved yet. They're still a little young, so it'll be next year or so. And, um, It'll be next year or so whenever they get bred and we are able to use them, but they're coming home. you get oriented here in this little paddock area. Let's go. Hey, I'll go after what they, they need. So, 
It's interesting to note the jersey, this one over here, is going after just straight greens. The jersey with Holstein, the black one, which is actually the produ milk producing one that today, she has a calf with her, is going after the tuber, the root of the turnip right now. So, but I thought I might try it. We're picking, picking the turnips and radishes so seeing how they like them a little sweet treat after a little frost they probably have quite a bit of sugar in them <laughs> they really don't know what to do with them First time, first. They, first time they've probably <laughs> ever seen a, a turnip for sure. These are not our our favorite turnips here. This is a uh, I don't even know what turnip this one is, but um, we have a mixture. Eh, Kai's gonna pull it out of my hands. <laughs> but uh, we do these with our our white salad turnips, and we. Uh, have quite a bit of mixture of them so we'll just continue to plant that until we're done with them and um, I guess we'll feed them to the cows and the pigs because uh, I'm gonna go down to Jeffrey and feed him some turnips too and I know the pigs will love them but she's this Jersey or this yeah Jersey is literally just eating straight greens she's not eating anything with turnip at all so all right guys there it is three new dairy cows now, what are we doing with the dairy cows? We are going to be doing a little experimentation. Um, as everybody kind of knows, the grain prices have just gotten out of hand since 2020. And we are going to do a little reduction on the grain and be feeding out these, well, these, the milk from these cows to pigs, to chickens, um, what better way to convert grass, which we have, into animal feed and be a little bit more independent on the farmstead. So that's the plan. We're going to uh, do some experimentation, kind of see what kind of ratios. I think it's a win-win no matter what. Um, even if it's or just a little bit of a reduction, uh, the cows will pay for themselves in a year or less. So, and... We can make some butter, we can make some cheese, we can make, well, we can make a little bit of everything. Uh, I don't do milk very well, so I'm kind of, we're kind of interested in doing some ghee as well. So that's what, that's what the surprise was. And um, we'll be hopefully doing a lot more uh, of this. So I thank you guys and um, for continued support. Um, hit that like button. Um, subscribe and uh, tell a friend. Until next time, pull up a chair and welcome to Tabletop Farms.